Hey guys, it's Alice Adams. Welcome back to Wonderland. So today I felt like I should absolutely give you an update about what's going on in my life because I haven't been posting for like three weeks in a row now and I'm so sorry, I feel awful. I was really into it for a while, I was really doing it you guys and then life just got so busy and I just haven't had a moment. So right now I'm actually sitting in my hair salon, in my new hair salon, yeah. Yes! Rogue Alchemy Beauty Lounge. Hit me up. That's been a huge change in my life and has really, I want to say engulfed my life, but that sounds negative, but I feel like it's the only way I could really describe it. I am currently here, like, four and a half hours before opening, <laughs> because the people who are installing my phone and internet today said that they needed me to be here at this time in case they showed up. It's one of those. Between seven and five, they will show up. So I need to be here just in case. That's why I've had a few moments, because I'm here and now I can just hang out with you guys. So, back in December, I made a really big decision to quit my job at the tattoo shop I was working at and open up my own hair salon. It was a really big decision for a lot of reasons. Obviously, opening up your own business before you're 25 years old is a big thing to take on and the other thing was just leaving my friends behind because I had become so close with everyone that I worked with there so it was really difficult to make that decision but ultimately I needed to continue to grow and I just felt like I had done all the growing I could do there there was no more room for advancement in my career there and I'm I'm always looking to take it to the next level and becoming a business owner and owning my own hair salon was the next step for me so I needed to make it happen and ultimately I feel so fulfilled I feel like I am living my destiny and it is just all the good feels so I'm very proud of myself this has been a lot to take on but I'm doing it and I'm freaking rocking it <laughs> first renovating the space took over my life so when I first came to the space and I signed the lease. It had three layers of 30 year old carpet on top of really falling apart 40 year old tile underneath and the person who was renting this space before me was here for 30 years and I don't think he had done any sort of cleaning or renovating in those 30 years. So it was extremely dirty. He was also smoking in the business so I had to bleach scrub the black and orange off of the walls before painting. It was great. We put a nice laminate that sort of looks like a gray hardwood and it's beautiful. And we had to paint obviously. So I went for like a very light gray as you can see behind me. That's why my background isn't orange right now because I am at work, not at home. There's just always something. When you're, when you're opening up a business, when you're doing any sort of renovations at all, there's always something. And of course, things come up at the last minute that take up more of your time that you weren't expecting. And just, it's been busy. And on top of that, I was still working full time. And yeah, so I'm really sorry, you guys. This is why I've not been with you. And this is why I've been sort of MIA for the last little bit. As much as it's been difficult, as much as it's been tiring and crazy, no matter what happened, it's it's worth it. It's 100% worth it. This is what I was born to do. This is what I was meant to do, and I regret nothing. So apart from that, I've changed my hair a few times, which you guys saw when I did it, the forest green. That was really fun. I wanted to keep that for a long time, but... Your girl can't keep any hair color for a long time, so <laughs> then we went peach, which you saw in my last video with Adele, and then I amped it up. If you guys follow me on Instagram, my link to that is in the description, 
you probably saw that I played with the tone of the peach for a little while. I was doing sort of a pinky peach, or like a rose gold color, an electric bright peach. I was really playing with it, but now I've toned it to be more of like, I'm calling this like a blush blonde color, but it is kind of rose goldy still. Just for a change, I'm trying not to bleach it right now, so my roots are really bad. We're just going to stay up here. <laughs> we are tall, we are strong. We do not have roots, nope, it's a secret. I'm actually really excited for my next hair endeavor. I'm gonna be giving my hair a rest for a while because we've been changing it up quite a lot and I just need to let it be. So I'm gonna be getting some braids and like mini dreadlocks installed and I'm really excited. It's a protective hairstyle. So it will be great and I'm thinking I'm gonna do like a white and blonde combination and then in the summertime, do like really colorful ones just for fun. My dogs are doing really well. And my cats are doing super well. And my family is doing well. My stepson just turned eight years old and he's so precious. And I can't believe he's already eight and he's so tall. And <laughs> so that's really fun. One day when he's older, I may feature him in some of my videos because you guys would just love him. And... I guess that's it. I just, I felt like I, I owed you guys an explanation as to what's going on. Like, at the salon right now, I'm the only one that works here because I haven't hired staff yet. So I'm doing like four people's jobs and I'm just one person. So it takes up a lot of my time. Like, when I'm here, I'm doing hair and then in between that, I'm servicing the clients that walk in the door, booking them appointments, I'm, you know, answering the phones, answering messages, all these things, and then after work, I have to get caught up on the messages on all the social media platforms and booking them, and so like I say, I just, I don't have any time, and I'm so sorry, but please know that I still love you guys so much, and I will be back when things settle down a little bit. I'm going to be posting as much as possible, as much as I can, Things are finally starting to wind down. I did just hire an esthetician who starts on March 1st. Her name is Emily and she's awesome. And yeah, yeah, life is good. I'm excited for spring. I'm not a huge fan of winter and it gets up to or down to minus 50 degrees Celsius here, which is extremely cold. So I'm just done with it. I'm so done with it. And the days, oh. See, I am tired. I'm writing myself down a little bit, you guys. Um, the days are getting longer, so that means that spring is on its way, and I'm so excited. What's the weather like where you are? Is it warm? Is it cold? One of my friends, her name's Jess, she lives in Perth, Australia, and she always posts these pictures when it's, like, really cold here. It's, like, summer for them, and I'm just, like, eh, like, crying into my Snuggie, like. <laughs> if you have any questions for me, I'd love to answer them. Please like this video if you missed me and you know what's coming subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and for more videos that are not like this but that are still cool i love you guys so much thank you so much for sticking by me through my absence thank you so much for your support and your subscriptions and your everlasting love bye see you next week bye